So on this one, we need to decide which side we want the x's to be on, the left or the right. The right. So notice we've got that negative 6x on the left side of the equals. We can't have it on the left. We wanted it on the right. So we need to make that a 0 by adding 6x to both sides. And this becomes a 0. We still have that 7 equals 9x plus 6x is a 15x. And that's minus 10. Next, we've got that minus 10, which we can have, being subtracted from the x. So we'll have to add 10 to both sides. Let's give us 17 equals 15x. Finally, to solve for x, we'll divide both sides by 15, giving us a 1 as the coefficient of x. And we get x equals 17 fifteenths. Now that we have this written, we simply need to do our multiplications first, which is right here and here. So this is what we have, but we need common denominators, so we'll need to change the 7 and the 10, so they have, they have a denominator of 5. All right, so this is what we have now. Now combining a lack of terms, negative 34 fifths plus 35 fifths is a 1 fifth. And this should be equals to 51. Oh, that's a fifth, not, not a 51 right there. Sorry about that. 51 fifths minus 50 fifths. That would give us another 1 fifth. That is a true statement. So we know now that our answer is 17 fifteenths because we checked it, and it is correct.